Leader, House of Representatives, Honorable Julius Ihobere, has stressed the need for the country to focus on repositioning the green, blue and digital economy, despite security concerns in the country. The Honorable lamented the spate of insecurity in the country, which he said remains a big threat bedeviling the sector. Hence, the need for a robust stakeholders meeting. Correspondent Grace Ike has more. The roundtable event is coming at a time the country is in dear need of diversifying her economy. The House Majority Leader, Honorable Julius Ihoveri, who represented the Speaker, Right Honorable Tatudin Abbas, made this known on Monday while declaring open a national roundtable with a the theme economic diversification from agenda to action through the unlocking of new vistas of opportunities in the green, blue, and digital economy. My comments will be a sort of step back to lay a foundation for enabling us to understand the importance of the green, blue, and digital economy. And why I decided to do this is that um, if you do not fully understand the factors and forces that have the capacity to undermine any policy in these three areas. The chairman of the House Committee on Monitoring, Evaluation and Implementation of Legislative Agenda, Honorable Dr. Patrick Umo, stressed the need for the community to pay more attention to priority areas to include economic diversification. Honorable Umo said Nigeria is in a sorry state, has the need to make laws and bring stakeholders together to salvage the situation. Nigeria is in a sorry state. That is being blunt. And so with the stakeholders here, I can assure you that at the end of this round table, parliament will be better equipped to make laws for our country. If we sit back and fold our arms, we will not move this country forward. Stakeholders at the event lauded the move, describing it as a step in the right direction. There is a need for Nigeria as a country, as uh, one of the largest economies on the continent, as a leader in uh, what we call global Africa, to start looking seriously at the question of diversification. It is imperative because we need to build a Nigerian economy that is more able to resist to external shocks. Overall goal is to, st to strengthen Nigerian democracy, but again, to develop the country sustainably. It needs a holistic approach by all branches of government to overcome the present challenges, of that we know that there are many, and we are glad to see the legislature doing their part. It is also not enough to just develop strategic and legislative objectives for the agenda, but rather you need to walk the talk, as we like to say it. This event had in attendance stakeholders from different sectors of the economy, with one aim in mind to chart the way forward on diversification. From the National Assembly, Grace Ike, ADBN News.